YouTube. It's me again. I was actually coming today. Yes, I am laying down on my bed because I'm not feeling well. I've not been feeling well for about a good week now. This week has been really rough for me. My ninth week. I'm now 10 weeks in one day. And it's been rough. I've been sick all week. And it's just been crazy. Yes, my shirt is a little pulled up right here. Um, because I'm about to let you all hear my baby's heartbeat. Uh, I explained before that I am using the fetal Doppler. And I ran out of the ultrasound gel. So I have aloe vera gel. Works just as well. Walmart, four bucks. So pretty much all this going that has been going on this past week has been um, mainly nausea and vomiting bad like i have not been able to keep anything down all week that's why i've not done my nine week update until now um i've been like terribly sick anytime i've eaten chicken all week i've gotten sick um anything spicy i've gotten sick and eating something that's spicy and it comes back up your throat will burn so it's been rough and not to mention i have children already so trying to you know be a mom and be sick has been a challenge within itself. I have not been able to do much other than lay down and try to sip fluids all day. So it's been rough. But um, I mean, nothing's really changed. I am having some cramping, no more spotting. Everything's normal. Um, I am having some quickening. And the reason I know this is what it is is because one, when I have my um, Doppler on my belly, I can hear the baby kind of going past it when I'm trying to look for it. Sorry if you can hear my kids in the background. They're being a little loud today. But I have my, um, you can hear the baby kind of go past it and then I kind of move it and stuff. But I also, it just feels like flutters here and there. Nothing big. And this is also a little common for women who have multiple children. So you know, you usually notice it a little earlier than someone who's a first time mom. So that is all for this update. And I'm going to go ahead and let you all hear my baby's heartbeat and how I find it. Just give me one moment. I'm going to sit this actually on my chest so that you all can hear it. I already have the gel on my, on my belly. I if I can find it. Okay, there we go. It's actually my heart rate. That's not it yet. I will all but you know. See what I mean? <laughs> See what I mean? <laughs> the baby's been sitting really low. Okay, hold on one moment. Let me see if I can find it. There we go. It's not really picking it up on the screen because the baby's really low today. There you have it. Ten weeks in one day. And oh, now it is. There it is. 35. That's my baby's heartbeat. Sweet sound to your ears when you get to hear your baby's heartbeat. I actually found it for the first time at eight weeks and three days, I think, or two days. Um, not the loud ones. Okay, the baby moved. 
But that'll be all for this week's update. Nine and ten weeks. Because everything is pretty much the same. I hope you all have a blessed week. And I'll see you on my 11th week update. Bye-bye.